Today, we're sharing six Google Docs tips to supercharge your productivity. Let's jump right in. Tip one, smart chips and building blocks. Smart chips and building blocks are small information cards that make a big difference in your docs. Just type at and a variety of options will pop up. For example, use the stopwatch smart chip if you want to time your script or the task chip if you want to assign a task to you or one of your collaborators. Building blocks take things a step further. These are pre-formatted pieces of content that you can insert into your document. There are a few helpful pre-built options like a building block for meeting notes that looks like this. Or you can create your own custom building blocks Maybe you have a template you use for all your projects or a legal disclaimer that you need to add to your documents. Just add it here. It's like having your own personal library of reusable content. Speaking of building blocks, there's a particularly useful one I want to highlight, and that's email drafts. Have you ever accidentally hit send on an unfinished email draft going out to all your colleagues and had to deal with the embarrassment of having your peers think that you don't know the difference between morning and morning? No, just me? My point is, sometimes it's good to draft important emails in Docs so others can review and edit. That's why Docs has a special building block that lets you draft emails in Docs before exporting them back to Gmail with a click of a button. Tip three, customize your dictionary. Maybe the field you're working in uses specific jargon and terms that you frequently use but Google Docs doesn't recognize. Or maybe you like to use specific abbreviations in casual documents like MTG for meeting. If you're tired of constantly seeing red underlines, don't worry, you can customize your dictionary. Just head to Tools, Spelling and Grammar, and Personal Dictionary. Add your words, and Docs won't identify them as misspelled anymore. Tip four, present and meet from Docs. When I'm collaborating in a doc and want to quickly sync with a teammate about what we're working on, the Google Meet feature right in Docs is an easy way to keep browser tabs to a minimum. Just click on the Meet icon on the top right and start a new call or join an existing one. You'll see the participants of your call on the right-hand side of your Google Docs window. It's as easy as that. Tip five, translate inside Docs. We live in a global world, and every so often, I work on projects that aren't in my native language. So to translate a doc, just go to Tools, Translate Document, and select one of the many available languages. And don't worry, you won't lose the original text. This feature creates a copy of the document in the language you selected. And lastly, a fun one, react with emojis. Maybe you don't want to add clutter to a document, but you still want to express your approval or appreciation of a certain line with a thumbs up. Or maybe, like me, you just think everyone should get to see a little cartoon hedgehog when they open their doc. Just highlight the part you want to react to and pick your emoji. I mean, come on, he's adorable. I hope you found these tips helpful. If you did, let me know in the comments or share a tip of your own. See you next time and stay productive.